Becoming closer to God through journaling has been life-changing. I have found that clear communication creates an environment for instruction. I started journaling in 2020 after losing my job and being completely provided for by God. Even though I was extremely grateful for the opportunity that God had afforded me to have free time and he was consistently providing my bills, especially even within the pandemic and excess, I still fell into the trap of the new age law of attraction and manifesting. And I thought that if I would write in these journals, things that I desire, such as my dream car or my dream location, that the universe would magically make them appear. In 2022, I decided that I was going down the wrong path. I had a wake up call and realized that I should not be writing down what I desire and instead thanking God for what I already have and working towards what I desire. So instead of manifesting, I began to address my scripting to God. I also started to get more specific about my current blessing, you know, being grateful within my journaling about what I have at this exact moment, such as a house, a car. This practice has expanded my inspiration to be in touch with what God wants for my life instead of my own desires. Imagine being a woman. Our feelings change daily. We really cannot control our results based upon new age teaching. What we can control is our ability to create relevant visuals and make our potential desires a reality. So recently I decided to start creating visuals for my journal using a mini photo printer. Okay, we need to talk about the importance of having a good printer for this. So one of the top photo printers on the market is this IDPRT photo printer. I got this one in March off Amazon. Uh, you can find it on Prime Day. They're having a big sale as well. I'll link it down below. But what I found is that when you're printing out images but what I found is that when you are printing out images to place in your journal, having a high resolution product is key. You can find this one on Amazon and I used mine a few months ago when I was printing out pictures for my vision board. So this printer is compact, portable, and produces stunning 4x6 prints. Really easy to set up. All you need to do is download the Hey Photo app on your iPhone or your iPad, whatever, and then you just Turn on your Bluetooth and it's Bluetooth operated so it'll show up on your device and you select connect. Super easy and then just from there you upload a photo and it prints it instantly. I just went into Canva, it's a completely free app and I created a custom design 4 by 6 inches and used one of their stock photos. One benefit of adding photos to your journaling practice is the ability to reduce stress and anxiety. I cannot tell you how many times my brain was ruminating on negativity and then I sat down to place gratitude and instantly I felt a relief. By putting your thoughts on paper as well as these printed visual images, you can gain a better understanding of your emotions and find ways to manage them. You have the ability to take all of your focus away from the natural world and push it towards success if you decide to write it out. Journaling can serve as a creative outlet. Writing can be a form of therapy and the visualizations allow for self-expression and creativity. It can even serve as an opportunity for you to put your thoughts on paper without the fear of judgment. The best part is that each picture has a self-adhesive sticker on the back, so you don't need any random, unreliable Elmer's glue or, you know, scotch tape to create any designs. When you let go of external fears, you can release any kind of trauma that you've been harboring for years and take away that instant urge for you to overthink. I love having a mini photo printer because you get the chance to print anywhere and anything from your phone instantly. So you don't have to go through the hassle of going to your local drugstore. I remember back in the day we'd go to Walgreens to print out Polaroids, but you don't have to deal with that. You could just do it at home or if you're in public and you want to print something from your phone, you can do that too. And it's it's super fun too just because it's instant. Like you'll have a photo in mind, like I got mine from canva.com, just their stock photos, and then you get it in real time. Like it's super fast. You would think this printer would take some time because it's wireless, but it is a very strong machine. Super reliable, very convenient, and 
To be honest, my journaling is more so twice a day in the mornings and in the afternoons, which has caused me to have a better understanding of my abilities. I wouldn't recommend starting with two times a day because that'll be an overload for you, but definitely start at least once a day with taking the time out to thank God for what he's done for you in that last 24 hours. Putting that on paper really announces to the world what you are focusing on because it's too often that if you don't explicitly state what you desire then your mind will go towards things you don't even prefer because there's a bit of pleasure in pain we often that's why often people watch horror stories or they love to watch drama or get on roller coasters because there's a bit of a thrill in the discomfort so typically journaling helps you ease that temptation that urge to seek the thrill that you normally get from negativity and embrace the fact that positivity is normal and it should be celebrated overall journaling can have many benefits and it's worth considering as a daily habit whether it's for stress relief personal growth habit tracking or creativity there are many reasons to give journaling a try Definitely check out the IDPRT photo printer on Amazon Prime Day. The link will be in the description down below. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, your week, your next hour. Just live in your purpose and love life. Okay, bye.